February 2018, Claudia Barreto expressed how Sara Geronimo's humility inspired her. That's after their performance on the ASAP stage where they sang the song Time After Time. Kasunod nito, nag-post si Claudia Barreto sa kanyang IG account at sinabing with the one and only at just Sara G. PH, thank you, Miss Sara, for being an inspiration to me and many. Your humility has made a mark on me. I will never forget. Lila Alcacid and Jada Vansado also took part in the said collaboration. And because we all agree that Sara is one of the most humble people in the showbiz industry, SMP has come up with ways on how we can incorporate humility in our daily lives, like our idol, Sara Geronimo. And we call this episode, Limang Paraan Kung Paano Maging Humble Tulad ni Sarah Geronimo. Number 1. Be Teachable and Remain Teachable Ang teachability ay isang napaka-importanting trait sa pagtatagumpay. Kung mapapansin mo, kahit napakahusay ni Sarah sa pagkanta, pag-arte at pagsayaw, pero handa siyang makinig at mag-absorb ng mga bagong learnings every time she has a chance. Gayahin natin ito, iwasang may too proud sa sarili dahil lahat ng sobra ay nakakasama. Number 2. Appreciate other people. Alam mo ba na kapag nagbigay ka ng isang sincere na compliment, tumatagos ito sa kaibuturan ng puso ng isang tao? Si Sarah is generous with praise. She gives compliments to others kahit minsan siyang binibigyan ng papuri pero binibigay niya pa rin ang credit sa iba. Kaya naman, Huwag mong ipagdamot ang iyong magagandang komento sa iba. If they deserve it, give it to them. Number 3. Accept your limitations. Kahit gaano tayo kagaling sa isang bagay, the truth is, laging may hihigit sa ating kakayahan. Kahit pa nga yung mga taong sinasabing the best, ay tiyak na meron ding mga kakulangan. Sa makatuwid, mas makabubuti na maging aware tayo at tanggapin ang ating mga limitasyon. Makakatulong pa nga ito para mas ma-improve natin ang ating mga sarili. Number 4. Don't ever brag. Minsan, may makikilala tayong mga tao na walang bukang bibig kundi ang kanilang sarili at mga accomplishments. They talk about themselves non-stop in conversations without realizing that they already turn people off. That's why it's refreshing to look at Sarah's demeanor. I've never heard her brag kahit sa The Voice where they sometimes need to highlight their achievements para pilihin sila as coaches. Kahit doon ay never nagyabang si Sarah. At number 5, apologize. Do you say sorry just because you want forgiveness? wrong. We should say sorry because we accept that we made a mistake and that we were wrong. If a person forgives us, that's a bonus. And apology is a big topic to discuss. Anyway, it deserves another video of its own. Why don't you hit the subscribe button so you'll get notified when the video comes up. Going back to Sarah Geronimo, she says sorry whenever necessary. So, before mag-end ng video na to, I have one question. Napansin nyo rin ba ang sobrang pagkahambol ni Sarah Heron mo? Kung napansin mo, comment mo dyan sa baba at sabihin mo kung kailan mo napansin at kung ano yung bagay na sinabi niya na nakapagpahanga sa'yo at nasabi mong ang humble naman talaga ni Sarah. There you have it. You've just watched 5 paraan kung paano maging humble kagaya ni Sarah Heron mo. Make sure to like this video and subscribe. Music